and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm here today with another massive H&M haul. Um, I feel really naughty for placing this order, however when I did my previous haul a couple of weeks ago, I just feel like the spring bits hadn't fully came out and uh, literally I should have waited a couple of weeks because oh my gosh, now they have the pretty spring bits. So to celebrate the occasion of all the H&M spring bits coming out, I've worn my favourite dress from last year. This is a dress from their Wildflower collection that they did last year, and I absolutely loved the whole collection, but this was by far one of my favourites. I absolutely love the little green colour, and I love the little flowers that are all over it. And I went onto the website and I saw that they have bought out some more little floral dresses in gorgeous pastel shades that I cannot wait to share with you. So I'm just going to get straight into the video because it is a very, very big haul. However, if you are new to my channel, then hi, my name is Molly and I post fashion videos every single Wednesday and on Sunday at 8 o'clock. And I would absolutely love it if you would subscribe to my channel. Um, but if you enjoy outfit inspiration in general, then do head over to my Instagram because I post daily over there. And definitely I'm going to be styling some bits from this haul over on my Instagram very soon. All the items that I show in this haul will be linked in the description box down below, so don't forget to check that out. So yeah, let's get into the video. Okay, so this is the first item that I have on. It is this absolutely beautiful little kind of floral mini dress. Um, this is just absolutely beautiful. It is the perfect dress for spring. It's exactly what I like to wear in summer as well. It's made out of a really lightweight material, um, super easy just to throw on. It's super stretchy so you're not gonna, you know when it's hot and you can like bloat, I think this dress would be still super comfortable. Um, I really really like the neckline with the puff sleeves. Really really nice and this dress was super affordable but however, when I looked on the website recently, um, I think this was the last dress that was on the website so hopefully they restock it because this is so so pretty and I really recommend it. Um, I do think it's just made out of polyester, there's no linen blend in this at all but it's super affordable, a really easy dress to chuck on and you do just look immediately put together. Um, so yeah, a great start out to the haul and I really really like this dress but of course I do think I need a tan with it because I'm looking very pale. Okay so here is the next dress that I have on. Um, it's in this kind of sage green colour with this tie waist um, in a chiffron fabric. I have it in a size UK extra small or a 4. It was £24.99 which is super affordable however when I look at it, it's pretty. Um, yeah, I like the colour, it is it is cute, it's sweet, but it's a little bit boring, I have to be honest. Um, I feel very kind of office wear, like spring office wear in this, which is perfectly fine. Um, I think this could look really, really cute for the office, but I'm just not, I'm not feeling it 100%. I just think that th there's nicer things that I own and there's nicer things in this haul, so... If you're looking for spring office wear, this could be really, really pretty for you, but for me, it's a no. Um, I'm just not feeling it. Okay, so I also got the same dress in this kind of lilac colour. I have to admit, I prefer the lilac colour. I think it's just a little bit more fun, more, like, nicer for spring. Um, but I'm still not 100% sold on it. I do think there'll be nicer items in the haul. Um, however, this is such an easy dress just to throw on. I do feel very elegant in it. Um, but I'm just not sure yet, we'll have to see. I mean, the more that I look at it, the more that I like it. I love this little tie waist detail. I don't know why, but I feel like the lilac one fits me better, even though it's the same size. Um, got it in a size extra small again, and it's $24.99. Um, but yeah, I'm absolutely loving lilac this season. It's definitely a colour that I've wanted to get more into my wardrobe. Um, I just absolutely love pastels in spring, summer, and they just bring me so much joy. And do you know what? I actually really like these sleeves. They're quite fun. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't think the material is the best. I have tried to give it a quick steam before I put it on, and as you can see, it's very, very creased. Um, but you can't expect that much when you are only paying £24.99 for a dress. Um, but still, uh, if you're if that kind of puts you off, then definitely don't go for this because I do feel like it's going to crease very easy. Uh, but again, this would still be more appropriate for work as well. Um, but yeah, it is quite cute and the perfect kind of spring pastel lilac colour uh, that I absolutely love. But I'm not sure that I'll keep it because, I don't know, I think they'll be nicer things. Okay, sticking with the lilac theme, I next have on this beautiful lilac themed outfit. 
Um, so starting off with the skirt, it is this really, really, really beautiful lilac midi skirt with a kind of elasticated waist. Um, so it's super, super comfortable, but also, oh my gosh, look at the movement in this skirt. It is absolutely beautiful. I am in love with the colour, um, and the skirt was only £24.99, which I think is super, super affordable. Um, it isn't the best material, it is quite like, it's just like a normal chiffron fabric, um, but I do think it looks really, really pretty and styled in the right way. I think it could look super, super luxurious and classy. Um, but I've just styled it with this little top, um, again from H&M obviously. It is this beautiful kind of puff sleeves top with the smocking and the ditzy floral pattern. I'm not sure whether you're going to be able to see, but the floral pattern is in this kind of lilac colour, which really picks up the colour from the skirt. Um, I have tied the, the sleeves at the back, I've tied the sleeves at the back quite tight to get this kind of like, not square neck because I feel like square neck would be a bit like here, but I've got it like, kind of like a halter neck, I'm not really sure what you call it, but I think it's really, really flattering. Um, it's again super comfortable, super breathable, and it was only £17.99, and I'm wearing both in a size extra small, and they fit me absolutely beautifully. Um, before I go on to the next outfit, I did just want to mention the shoes that I've been styling with each of these um, outfits. So they are these really, really pretty little wedges. Um, I'll show some side clips here of the outfit in full length so that you can see. Um, but these are so, so comfortable. Um, they've got a nice he heel height. They're in this kind of linen beige beige colour that's going to pair with so many different outfits. And they've got a little ankle strap as well, so they're not going to fall off your feet. Um, but I think they look so, so cute with all the outfits that I've shown so far. Very spring, summer, very boho chic. And I absolutely love it. I just can't stop twirling in the skirt. I feel so, so pretty. I feel like a princess, honestly. Um, and from H&M, I, I, I do really, really like it. Um, so yeah, I think this might be a keeper. Okay, so I just wanted to show you this top just whilst I had the skirt on. It's the exact same style of top that I had on before, but it's in this kind of peachy, creamy, beige um, colour with the lilac kind of flowers on it. This is a similar pattern to the dress that I had on at the start of the video. Um, I do have this top on in a medium, but I just really wanted to try it out. Um, so obviously it is quite big on me, but I just wanted to show it you because the design of it is absolutely beautiful and I thought a few of you might like it. Um, it obviously looks really pretty with this skirt as well. Um, and just a really, really pretty top, but obviously it's too big, so I'm going to have to send it back. But definitely keep your eyes out for it, because it is such a beautiful little top, and so, so easy to pair with like little skirts like this. Okay, so here is the next dress. And I think this is a running theme with the kind of chiffron sage dresses, but I just feel like they're a little bit too mature. I'm not sure whether it's the colour or what, but... I just feel like this is a little bit too mature for me. Don't get me wrong, it's an absolutely beautiful dress um, and it'd look really, really pretty for work, but there's just something about it that just doesn't make me feel myself, um, which is really strange because I do quite like midi and maxi dresses. I think they can look super chic and cute and elegant, but I'm not, I think it might be the colour paired with the length, um, which is a shame because I really, really like this colour. Um, maybe in a few years time I'll be able to wear dresses like this and feel myself but just right now I just don't think that they're the kind of style for me but honestly it is such a pretty pretty dress I think it was around £34.99 I have it in an extra small and I would say it fits quite nice and um, the only thing I would say is that I feel like the sleeves are a little bit unflattering with the length that they are um, but that's just me being quite fussy um, I love this kind of little tie waist detail and I love the little like kind of peep neckline here. I think having a little pearl necklace um, showing underneath would be really really pretty and elegant. Um, and I would totally wear this dress to work but I don't know, I just don't really feel myself in it. It doesn't get me excited but it is still a really pretty dress. Um, but yeah, I'd love to know what you think, so let me know in the comments below whether you like this dress or whether you just think it's just not me and I should just stop trying to make it be me. <laughs> okay, so I have on the same dress again in the pink colour. I actually have this in a size small. Um, I must have just ordered the wrong size by mistake, but 
I don't know whether it's because it's a size too big or what, but I'm not feeling this dress at all, like not even a little bit. Um, the colour is really, really pretty, but um, do you know what? I'm just not a massive fan of this shift from material. Um, I have steamed it and it just looks creased. It doesn't look very expensive. Um, it could look really, really elegant if you're older or going to work. Um, but I'm just not a massive fan of it, which is such a shame, because when I saw it on the website, I just thought, oh, that's going to look so, so pretty. Um, I don't know, maybe it's just like the mood that I'm in when I'm wet, like I started off the video in a little mini dress, but it is quite pretty. I love the colour. Um, I love the movement in it. Perfect for spring, but just not me again. Um, yeah, definitely not in a size small either. And for $34.99, I do think that the first dress in the video was nicer, and I think that was like $17.99. So, yeah, I definitely prefer that dress over this dress, but this could look really, really pretty. Again, with a fascinator, if you're going to a wedding or whatever, I think that this could look really nice. I mean, these dresses are very, very versatile, but... They just feel a little bit too mature for me just now. Okay, now this is a midi dress that is definitely a bit of me. It is just so, so extra in this beautiful, beautiful blue colour. I love these massive sleeves um, and the umpire kind of waistline. It's given me very much Bridgerton vibes. Um, it's so, so unusual and the colour goes really nice um, even when I'm pale. Um, so yeah, I, <laughs> I'm in love with this dress already. Um, the cotton kind of poplin fabric is one of my favourites to wear in spring summer. It's definitely more breathable and has a lot more structure to it than normal like linen. Um, and I absolutely love it. I think it's so, so fun. So I got this dress in a size extra small and it was £24.99. So definitely cheaper than the other two midi dresses that I showed you. And I absolutely love it. Um, I think it comes up, it fits quite nice. I mean, look at this like waist, like not waist I mean look at this this fit up here it just looks absolutely gorgeous such Bridgerton vibes I think with some white gloves um, and a little pearl necklace I think this would look so princessy um, and a little pair of white castanya wedges or even these little wedges I just really really like it. it makes me smile it's super comfortable this is giving me like such like garden party vibes like going for a barbecue or something like that I would just feel so so pretty in this especially with a nice little kind of straw hat and a little basket bag oh, you can dress it up or dress it down and I absolutely love it this color is just absolutely stunning okay so completely different vibe now but I've got on this really really cozy cardigan um, I've been looking for a longer lined cardigan for a while, I mean literally since before lockdown even happened because um, I wanted to be cosy in the house, I didn't want to have the heating on all the time especially now that gas prices are so high um, but I wanted to have a cosy cardigan that looked quite smart um, but felt like a dressing gown and this ticks all of the boxes it's in this really really nice kind of beige colour and it's ribbed and the material is really soft and snuggly and it definitely feels like a dressing gown it's so nice um, and I feel like this is just going to be so easy to pop on like spring and summer dresses when you get a little bit cold uh, but yeah I do think it's a really really nice option it was £34.99 and I'm wearing it in an extra small and I, I think it fits nice um, and it's so so snuggly so I think we've got a winner here for this cardigan um, but obviously a little bit boring being as this is a spring haul so underneath um, I do realise that this skirt looks see through um, but it's just because this is like a white bodysuit and if I was to wear a skirt like this I would have to wear like nude underwear which I usually do um, but these are two items that I thought would pair quite nice together but um, maybe even if I just put like a pair of nude tights on over the top of the bodysuit it wouldn't show through the skirt and um, that's a hack that I do sometimes use with um, shorts and stuff if I'm wearing bodysuits but I really really like the skirt it is more of a heavy material than the lilac skirt that I showed towards the start of the video 
Um, again with the elasticated waist, I do feel like it fits my waist a little bit better um, and it's not going to crease as easy as the chiffon kind of lilac skirt. Um, so a really nice little skirt that I think is going to pair so well with loads of different types of knitwear in autumn winter but also will look really nice in spring with cute little tops and um, pairs really nice with green, with pink. Um, and even the little ditzy floral tops that I showed at the start of the video. So yeah, just one of those kind of staple pieces. Um, and as I said, I'm really, really into midi skirts at the moment. Um, they're just so super elegant and I would like to get some more into my wardrobe. I think I mentioned in a previous video that I really want to do a video styling midi skirts. And yeah, I think this one would be a core staple to have. Um, but I have it on with this bodysuit. And what drew me to this bodysuit was the neckline. This is giving me such Bridgerton vibes. It is so, so flattering. Um, as you can see, it's kind of like this sweetheart neckline. And let me tell you, this bodysuit, it is so, so, so soft. It is so pretty. Um, and I absolutely love it. It is one of those kind of really basic pieces that I think I'm going to reach for so often, even under little cardigans like the one I was just wearing, but definitely a really, really nice little basic piece for spring, summer, and I'm definitely going to keep it because it just feels so, so nice on the body, and I do feel quite nice in it. I feel like it flatters my figure very, very well. So just whilst I have this skirt on as well, I also picked up this little crochet cardigan. Um, I do feel like this outfit is washing me out just a little bit. I am in need of a tan. I just haven't wanted to put on fake tan recently. I've been really, really lazy with it. Um, but yeah, I do really, really like this little crochet cardigan. Um, I just think it looks so cute and very, very kind of cottage core vibes. I think it'd look nice even with a little pair of white shorts or Zimmerman shorts. I think that would look really nice. But equally, I do think it looks nice with this little outfit. Um, yeah, it's just one of those kind of staple pieces again quite a basic item but just adds that little bit of interest with a pearl necklace I think would look amazing I sound like a stuck record saying that but I do feel like pearls are for spring and well pearls are for every season but I do think it'll look really nice with lower necklines like this so I got the cardigan in a size extra small and it was $17.99 I think super affordable um, and it's not going to keep you warm I mean it's quite a thick material but it, because of the kind of crochet details it won't keep you super warm but it's that nice kind of lightweight knit for spring. So yeah, another really really pretty piece. So now getting on to some of the items that I was absolutely so excited for, the ones that I was kind of most excited for in this haul slash order when I ordered it. Um, it is of course this beautiful little midi maxi dress which is a linen blend with this beautiful beautiful ditzy floral pattern in the lilac ditzy floral pattern um, I absolutely love the wildflower collection last year and this year I feel like they're coming back as well I just I just think it's so so cute it's very little house on the prairie um, very cottage core. It is just so me in spring summer. I love wearing dresses like this and the fact that it's a linen blend makes it so so much better than last year. Um, the material definitely feels more high quality um, and yeah I am absolutely in love with the little pattern. So I have this dress on in an extra small and it was only $24.99. Like $24.99 for a linen blend dress. Um, it's just you just can't argue with it really and it does really feel high quality. Um, and yeah, just look how pretty the floral pattern is on it. It's just absolutely beautiful. So, so pretty. And I've just popped on this little cardigan over the top just to pick up the kind of lilac flowers. Um, I've got on this little lilac cardigan. Um, the perfect kind of spring knit. You could even wear this buttoned up with a pair of shorts and I think that would look really pretty as well. Um, the only thing that I would say is the arms are very long so I've kind of rolled them up. Uh, but I do really like it with this dress and the little wedges. I just absolutely love this and I cannot wait to wear it. I'm definitely going to be keeping this outfit. I just absolutely love it. As I say, the kind of midi maxi length is super, super versatile and also super elegant. Um, it's just that easy dress just to chuck on when you want to just look so elegant and so chic but you don't really want to put on a lot of effort. It's a great dress for garden parties and barbecues and just spring summer walks and I just I absolutely love it it makes me so so excited for spring summer and I know how much I love the wildflower coll collection last year and this collection is getting me just as excited so definitely 
one to keep and I absolutely adore it. So next outfit, going back to something a little bit more mini style, um, I have on this really cute little top and skirt outfit. The top is this really cute little kind of corset style top. Um, with the puff sleeves, the sweetheart neckline and it also comes into a kind of little v-shape here which is quite flattering. It's also very Bridgerton inspired, I really really like it um, and it was super affordable as well, I can't remember how much it was but I just have it paired with this little seersucker kind of skirt. I wasn't expecting much from this skirt when I bought it, um, it was only 14 99 and when I looked at the reviews it was only two star but I can't really see why, I mean for an affordable skirt it's not even see through, I mean I do have nude underwear on underneath but it's not see through at all, I really kind of like the structure, it's quite flowy, um, um, super fun and girly uh, as usual, my favourite saying, um, but yeah I do like this outfit paired together. But yeah, I don't really see why the skirt was so low rated, but it is quite sweet, just an easy one to chuck on. Um, it's going to go with so many different kind of tops, a great staple to have in your wardrobe. So definitely pick this up if you're looking for a little white skirt, you can never have too many of them in my opinion. Um, yeah, and this seersucker kind of adds a different texture and is just quite an interesting element. Um, I've got it on with these little sandals, which are these kind of pink velour sandals that's them there they're in this kind of really nice pink color uh, this is kind of velour so i don't know how well that will wear but um they are really really sweet i have them in a size two and i think they were really affordable as well i think they were only 10 pounds um so yeah i really really like them anyway yeah so that's the full outfit but i do have just one last item to show you um it's this really cute little pink cardigan I just thought that this would be again really really good for spring um, to chuck over little white dresses or just any kind of floral dress as well I'm always in the lookout for a nice cardigan I do tend to wear them quite a bit in spring summer and I thought this was a really really nice option I think it was only $17.99 so again really affordable um, and I just think although quite basic it is quite cute and it's not kind of taken away from the outfit at all it just adds that little bit of pop of colour and it's in this really nice kind of blush pink colour which I really really like so yeah little pink and white outfit just to splash my favourite colours in there <laughs> okay so this unfortunately is the last item of the video but this was the dress that I was so 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 excited to share with you I was so excited to take it out the box I just saw it on the website and fell in love with it I absolutely love this kind of lilac -y blue colour it's definitely like a forget-me-not colour if I got that right I'm not sure but I'm just in love with the colour um, it just screams spring and I just absolutely love it. I think going to a garden centre, afternoon tea, this will look absolutely beautiful. Um, I'll come up close so you can see the colour properly. Um, I don't even think that it washes me out that bad um, when I'm pale. I think that it kind of complements my pale skin tone, which I absolutely love. Um, I love it when items actually look nice on me when I'm pale because it's such an effort to wear fake tan. Um, but yeah, I definitely feel my feminine girly self in this, but also feel super elegant. I think this with a little white cardi like tied over the top with a little straw hat, a little basket bag, that would be so, so cute. But yeah, I just absolutely love it. I love the ditzy kind of floral pattern again. This time it's in like these kind of like peach flowers, um, which I probably wouldn't love on their own, but with this kind of colour, it just looks absolutely beautiful. I would absolutely love it if this dress came in like a pistachio green colour as well. Um, but I absolutely love it and I'm so glad I managed to get my hands on it. Again, it was $24.99. It's a linen blend. Um, it still feels really, really good quality and I absolutely adore it. But unfortunately, that is the end of the video. I really, really hope that you enjoyed it. H&M have some amazing spring pieces out just now and I could not resist placing an order. So I really hope that you think it was worth it. Please let me know your favourite item down in the comments below. Don't forget that everything will be linked in the the description box down below as well but that is all from me and I will see you next time thank you so much for watching bye, bye.